Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever time it is where you are. May God continue to bless you and your loved ones. Let us pray. Dear Lord God, thank you. Thank you for all you do. Thank you for your healing power. Thank you for your grace. We thank you because you loved us first. Please reach out and touch the heart of someone watching or listening this program and bless them with your love. And all God's people say, Amen. John 3, 16, for God so loved the world. To begin in the middle of the chapter with the word for means a conclusion has been reached. A theory has been put forth somewhere before this part. Study your Bible to see what John says in the first 15 verses. Well, let's start with the entity God. Who? What is that? How do you define this energy, this power? It is impossible for the mind of mankind to conceive of that awesome power. What we know is the power creates, heals, makes things happen, and also loves. God loves this world, his creation. Many times, including every day, God steps in to help the creation he loves. Throughout the Bible, God steps in and shows his love. God has so much love for the world he created that he did something to help mankind again. He didn't pick one part of his creation. He did not sanctify one race, one tree, one river, one preacher, one rich person's household, one poor man's farm. No, he loves the entire world. Like the song says, he's got the whole world in his hands. Yes, that includes me and you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Where would we be without your love? Continuing, that he gave his only begotten son. We did nothing to deserve this gift. Something God saw made him do this for mankind. He not only created this world, but gave us a map to have a better quality of life while in this world. He could have sent someone else. In effect, he gave of his own essence to show the way. How many of us would go this far? How many of us would give away the only one of something we love? Notice that God continues to give us of himself. Some of us can't find two minutes to give thanks for this wonderful gift. He gave us his only son so that we can be saved. What a blessing, what a loving God. This Bible verse was what led me to give my life to Christ. It touched me so deeply, I have not looked back. Just like you, I have times when my faith is tested. This Bible verse grounds me with reverence and a smile. That whosoever believeth in him should not perish. God knew everyone would not believe. We were created with free will. The welcome table was set so that whosoever believed in Christ would benefit. In fact, for those who believed, they would not, will not perish. 
Christ did not come to earth empty-handed. He had power, miracles, signs, and wonders with him. There were public officials, lawyers, and historians who frequently had conflicts with Jesus. Some even tried to question healing on the Sabbath. However, not all of them were against Christ. They were called scribes and Pharisees. In some cases, they saw his work with their own eyes and still did not believe. Moving on, but have everlasting life. Everlasting life, life lasting forever. Glory to God. God loves us and wants us to have life and have it more abundantly. Not just in our daily lives experiences, but also after we shed this mortal body. Everlasting life is a long time. Only God can make that promise. It is possible and available for all of us. God sent his only son, Christ, to show us the way. What a beautiful thing. Do you want everlasting life? If you have not accepted Christ in your life, but want to have everlasting life, pray this prayer with me. Dear Lord and Savior, I am a sinner. Please come into my heart and show me the way to love you more with all my heart and soul. And love my neighbor. In Jesus' name, amen. We hope you have been blessed by the hearing of the word. If you have any questions or comments, send an email to comfortingword at gmail.com. I look forward to hearing from you. I'm Minister Lorraine. Thank you for joining me here at Comforting Word Ministry. See you next time. May God bless.